Victims were classmates at Combs High School in Santan Valley. Both were killed in separate incidents one month apart. So the community honoring their memories tonight. Here's ABC 15's Ashley Holden. The East Valley community with candles in hand walking for the second night in a row for Preston Lord and his family. Preston's mom is like a family member to us. It's been a month and we wanted to do something to let her know that we're still thinking of her and that we want justice for Preston. When you lose a child, it's so important to have that support and for something like this for the family is so incredibly meaningful. The 16 year old was assaulted in October at a Halloween party and later died. Hours before the walk Wednesday night, Queen Creek police releasing an update in the case. Despite multiple persons of interest, still no arrests. It's been a month since our family got a call that would change our lives forever. At Tuesday's walk, we heard from Preston's family for the first time. The teen's aunt speaking through tears, saying they all want answers. But more than anything, we don't just want an arrest, we want a conviction. That message echoed in the police department statement Wednesday. We're told there have been hundreds of interviews, nearly 50 search warrants served, but Chief Randy Bryce saying, while the police department needs probable cause for an arrest, successful prosecution requires proof beyond a reasonable doubt. Chief Bryce calling the investigation extensive and intricate. About 10 minutes from that community walk, a growing memorial for 17-year-old Jameer Jenkins. He was shot and killed Tuesday night here in the Cambria neighborhood in Santan Valley. Both Jameer and Preston, students at Combs High School. Jameer's mom sharing these pictures with me of her son. The suspect in his case, also 17, already in custody. Teammates and friends stopping by to leave flowers and balloons, describing the teen as loyal, goofy, and a leader on the football field. With two violent deaths, community members calling on parents to step in. What I want to see change is parents to be more involved. Family starts at home and the behaviors start at home as well. Parents bringing their kids by the memorial for Jameer, telling me both losses hitting their community and kids hard. In Santan Valley, Ashley Holden, ABC 15, Arizona. Ashley, thank you.